What's up, guys? John here, and I'm with my good friend and former ex-professional NFL player, Sean King. So today, Sean came in. He's already had his blood work. He's had his consultation with the medical provider. Now's the fun part. He got his regimen in the mail, and we're going to go through a full tutorial of all his medications so he understands what these medications are, how to utilize these medications, and what the game plan is going forth. So we're going to document all of his journey for you guys so you guys can see a first up close and personal look at this stuff and uh, see what he's going through and what he has to do you know for his regiment and uh, the first thing you know I told Sean was I said don't worry when you get this package <laughs> you're gonna be overwhelmed like you can see the stuff come in right yeah, it's a lot. Crazy. <laughs> yeah. so you know for somebody that hasn't done something like this obviously you know they're gonna be like oh my god what did I get myself into right <laughs> right what is all this stuff now fortunately for Sean he's in the area mm -hmm. you know he can come in you know and if you're a patient in the area you guys can come in and we'll give you a full tutorial now, if you guys aren't, you guys can always go look at our YouTube page, Titan Medical Center. We have all the instructions on how to do these injectables, how to mix the injectables, what they are and such. So you guys can go there for educational purposes or to research you know, your regimen. If you have any questions, obviously call and text us here. We're always here for your support, uh, especially for Sean. He's got my personal number, so you can get a hold of me anytime. All right, so we're gonna unbox these medications. <laughs> all right, and we're just gonna talk about this. It's a lot. Alright, so we're good. Oh, God, it just keeps coming, guys. It keeps coming. It's Christmas. It's Christmas. It, it literally is Christmas. So, let's start pulling some of these bad boys out of the box and seeing exactly what Sean has and uh, what he's going to do and how he's going to do it. Alright, so let's line these bad boys up. Alright, so the first thing we're just going to address here real quick is you see these big packages. So, you got two packages here. And they're pretty big, right? And these are all needles, all syringes and needles. So the first one you got is you've got your 30 gauge, half inch, one ml insulin syringes. Now these are gonna be used with Hercules Potion, HCG, everything that's water-based, right? These are your big testosterone needles. Now, these are a lot bigger than the average insulin needle, obviously. You're talking about a 23 gauge, one inch, it's a little bit bigger. Mm -hmm. You're only going to utilize these with just testosterone. So that's the only thing you got to worry about with these because we need to go make sure it goes deep enough. And because of the viscosity of the oil and the testosterone, it's going to be able to push the syringe a lot easier. If we were to use one of these, and you'll see what I'm talking about when you open it up, um, it's going to be a lot harder because the bevel of this syringe it's real small, mm -hmm. it's a lot harder, so it's gonna be a lot harder and slower to push that testosterone through there. That's why we're gonna utilize this, mm -hmm. okay? All right, back to that, just wanna make sure it's all clean. All right, so we've got the needles out of the way. You see the big pack of needles? We'll talk about which one goes with which so you understand it as well. All right. And then you'll get this little kit right here, and if you have anything that needs to be mixed, diluted, and I'll show you which ones need to be and why, and you'll understand real simple afterwards. But you'll get this bacterial static water with a mixing syringe and a needle, okay? All right, so let's get into his therapies. Let's see what we first. All right, so we started Sean off on a good regimen. We don't want to overdo it because mm -hmm. right now you're seeing a lot of boxes and stuff like this this could be overwhelming that's what i told sean okay the first thing we're going to start off with is sean's hrt so we can talk about his testosterone replacement therapy and the other medications that are going to go with it all right so the first one your testosterone okay okay so Sean has his personalized regimen of how much he's going to take per week. These are his estrogen blockers. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's going to go right along with it. Okay. So ATG. And you see how this is powdered? Mm -hmm. So this is the one that dilute that. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. This is the one thing that we're going to have to dilute, and we're going to use this little kit right here that we send along with it okay. to dilute your medication. Now, with anything that gets diluted. Before it gets diluted, it's fine. You can carry, carry it around with you anywhere and not have a problem. After you dilute this, this medication needs to go in the refrigerator. Okay. okay? All right, so let's talk about these medications and what they're gonna do for you and why you're taking them. 
So testosterone replacement therapy. So testosterone, we're going to replace the testosterone in the body that was on the lower end or deficient. Mm -hmm. Right. We want to raise those numbers up to the optimum level of the range. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that's why we're taking testosterone. Right. The next thing is, is when we take testosterone, it's going to aromatize into other hormones. So one particular is estradiol or estrogen. Mm -hmm. At that point, we want to make sure the aromatization is lowered because if the aromatization goes too high and your estrogen goes too high, water retention, irritability, mm -hmm. sensitivity, and fat deposits, right. possible gonadotropin too afterwards. All right, so that's man. Boobs. Man boobs. That's right. Okay. So we want to make sure that doesn't happen. Okay. And then the next thing is is HCG. The reason we're taking HCG. The reason we're taking HCG is because when we're introducing testosterone from an outside source, mm -hmm. right? Whether it's a cream, it's an injectable, it's a pellet, whatever it is, we want to make sure that your natural function does not get shut off completely or suppressed. Mm -hmm. And when you put an outside source of this testosterone in the body, what happens is is those numbers or that that function gets suppressed. There's a signal that goes from the brain to the testicles, and that signal says, "Hey, listen, we need your work." When it realizes that it's getting this outside source, it shuts off that signal to the testes and it says, listen, we don't need you to work anymore. We're already getting this from somewhere. Mm -hmm. So at that point, what will happen is, is if you keep taking testosterone without some gonadal support for the testes, you're going to get shrinkage, little semen production. It's going to get tight down there. It's not comfortable. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's not optimal either. Um, the whole reason you're doing testosterone replacement is to get all the benefits without the negative side effects. Right? Right. You want to make sure you're getting all the benefits and not having no issues or problems. If you're not taking an estrogen block or an estrogen goes too high, you can start crying for frisky commercials. <laughs> I'm not joking. Like, you know, like you watch Titanic, you're getting all, all crazy. You're like, oh my God. Don't like, see. And this never, yeah. Like, <laughs> Jacob, where is he with it? Please. And so, yeah, so we don't want that, okay? Um, plus irritability. So the, the myth with testosterone is you take testosterone, you become more aggressive, you get roid rage. The real problem with roid rage is because estrogen and other hormones are out of whack, and that's what causes that, mm -hmm. okay? So we want to make sure. So, at that point, we're going to make sure you're all dialed in, estrogen blocker at your prescribed dose, and that could be different for everybody, okay? And that's why the medical provider went over what's good for you. There's not a cookie-cutter plan. Mm -hmm. There's some things that work for the masses of people out there, but not might not work for one person to the other. Right. Just all depends, okay? And that's why we blood test, and that's why we make sure you follow up. So if there's any issues once we start this, so once we start it uh, in week two, per se, if you're saying, well, listen, I'm getting sensitivity to the nipples, uh, I'm just not feeling right, or some things are off, that's when you or any other patient should call or text in. We talk to them, we evaluate things. If we need to send them in for just a blood test for just one thing or the other, we can do that and we can dial the medication so it's right. Once we get that sweet spot, mm -hmm. once we know, listen, this is the dose of things we're gonna do. And it's smooth sailing. We know if you're consistent with the medication, the number should be there, everything's working like they should, everything's optimal, working on harmonic balance, and everything's gonna be great. Okay, and then we can add on to those things. So testosterone replacement therapy is gonna be a game changer for you as far as it goes. I'm gonna wait till the end to dilute this mm -hmm. because this is gonna to need to be refrigerated. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I just want to go over what that was and how we're gonna take this. So okay. with testosterone, we're gonna take this two times a week, all right? For your regimen, they prescribed Monday and Thursday. Okay, mm -hmm. or you can change it up to Tuesday and Friday or Wednesday and Saturday. Just so you have those days in between. Okay. okay. The reason why. Okay. So it's easier to just take one shot, your full dose, and go on your week. Mm -hmm. Right. But what happens is, is when we take that one dose, it shoots up the testosterone to one level, and then it just starts going down, going down, going down, going down. So to the end of the week, you start feeling like, man, I don't, I, don't, I feel like the old. Like what's going on here? So when you you divide the shots into two shots in the dose, it's going to get you up keep you up on an even keel and you're going to be consistent in the way how you feel and what's going on okay. so that's the reason we do that okay estrogen blocker i believe you're taking monday wednesday friday so just be consistent with that and all the labels have the uh yep okay so if you have any questions about any of your medication yes they say it right on here so it says like take one tablet by mouth every other day okay okay and even with uh your hcg it's going to stay on here, and a lot of people don't read this. Like, well, I don't know what I should reconstitute this with, right? And they read on here, it says, reconstitute vial with 6.5 mLs of bacterial static water and inject 20 units, 0.2 mLs, mm -hmm. subcutaneously. Okay? 
So that's a tutorial for your medications. Hormone replacement therapy, which includes your testosterone, aromatized inhibitor, and ACG, along with your injectable vitamin amino acids, Hercules Potion, and Titan Complete, and then your ECA Stack Plus. So you should be set up for success. All right. You're ready to go. Ready all to right. go. All right, so we're going to get you rocking and rolling. I'll get you all set up here, and then we'll go over the tutorial with you and your wife to make sure that we have everything right. Perfect. Okay? Appreciate it. My man. For sure. Yeah.